Welcome to this LNR update video, the new 3.09D Cypher program. LNR is introducing an updated Cypher program to all Cyphers in the field. This will be Cypher version 3.09D and will introduce two small changes. Cyphers will receive this new version during a regular send and receive C Express transmission. Look for that to occur in January of 2013. There are minimal changes to the Cypher program, one in the reset work option and the other in order entry. The change in the order entry option provides an easier way for a reset team leader or service rep to order any sets missing reorder labels. Up to now, to order a missing reorder label during order entry, one had to also order the product for that label. With this new program, that changes and here's how. While creating an order and from a blank scan enter item screen, key or scan in the UPC code of the item with the missing label. Then key in zero for the quantity and press enter. The cipher used not to accept a zero entry. Now that zero entry triggers the label field to change to a Y or yes and the label for that SKU is then sent to the service rep's home address. Meanwhile, the product order quantity remains zero. That item will not appear in the next order. The second change is in the reset work option. It occurs after a reset team leader or service rep has reported reset work and keyed in the status and related issues for that reset. At that time, you'll see an entirely new screen, as you see here. This screen will allow you to key in additional information for the reset you're currently reporting. The screen will show count at the top and requires three entries. The first is NBR OOS, meaning number of out of stocks. Here you key in the total number of out of stocks for the brand you've reset and that you're reporting on. Key in that number. In this case, let's say six out of stocks. The next field is NO tags, meaning number of missing reorder labels on that brand's set. All you're doing at this point is reporting a number, but as we indicated earlier, this new program allows you to also order those missing labels. Here we'll say we're missing eight labels. The next field is manager sign off. Here you key in the name of the store or department manager signing off on your reset work activity for that day. All three of the new fields require an entry. An accurate entry provides LNR with important information. Any questions on any of these entry fields should be directed to your reset coordinator or senior merchandiser. Enter to that last field and you move on to the fixture screen and everything remains the same as before. As a special note to any reset team leader, if you reported any missing reorder labels while in the reset work option, you'll want to go to order entry in the cipher to order those missing labels to be delivered to the service rep's house. From the main menu, select number three, order menu. From the order menu, select number one, order entry. Enter through till you're at a blank scan enter item screen. Using the large yellow button on the cipher, scan in the UPC code or using the cipher keypad, manually key in the 11 digit UPC code for any item missing a reorder label. Once the item is on the screen and the cursor is on the quantity field, press zero to change the quantity to zero. Press enter. As explained previously, the label field then changes to a Y or yes. Press enter. Again, you've ordered the label without the product and you return to a blank scan enter item screen. 
Repeat until you've ordered all missing reorder labels. Then press Escape once and enter till you're back to the order menu. Press Escape again, you're back to the main menu. Later that day when preparing your cipher for transmission, a screen will come up that you might not be familiar with. It's the Send List screen. Here, select or tag the label order by pressing the dot key, thus placing an asterisk to the left of the order. This is key as a failure to tag the order means it will not be sent in the transmission. From that point, proceed as usual in preparing your cipher for transmission. And that concludes this LNR update video, the new 3.09D cipher program.